Everyone who can work from home should do so. It's been the Scottish Government's advice throughout this COVID-19 crisis. So it's a concern to us that we're getting call after call to our COVID-19 helpline looking for advice because employers are expecting individuals who've successfully been working from home for months to move back on site. Because what's a pretty good indication that you can work from home? That you've been working from home? And sometimes the reasoning behind these moves amounts to little more than a desire to create a bit of a buzz about the place. We'd suggest such employers have got their priorities all wrong. In our briefing on the 22nd of September, Nicola Sturgeon said, to employers who have encouraged workers who could work from home to go back to the office, I say, please rethink this now. Sadly, we're seeing a lot of evidence that this is not being rethought. Instead, ill thought out moves are being made to bring workers back in to non-essential call centres and offices in direct contravention of government guidance. Do we have any sympathy with those who say, well, oh, the guidance is confusing? On this, no. Aye, OK, the Scottish Government route map initially said non-essential offices and call centres should not open before the 14th of September. But things have changed. Because of the increase in number of cases, it was then decided that phase of the route map couldn't go ahead on that date. Instead, a review had been planned for the 1st of October. But again, with increasing numbers of cases, hospital admissions and once again deaths, the guidance from the Scottish Government is this. Non-essential offices and call centres should not yet reopen. That seems clear enough to us. This is about public health. It's about reducing the risk of exposure to the virus. Because the first principle in implementing risk control measures is eliminating exposure to the hazard. So it's about preventing the people from having to use public transport to travel to work. It's about preventing social mixing in workplaces where physical distancing can't be maintained. It's about a collective effort to stop the spread of this virus, to stop it reaching those who are vulnerable, who are most susceptible to the harm caused by COVID-19, both in our communities and in our own homes. So if you've been asked to go back to working on your employer's premises and you feel your job can be done from home, let us try to help. We can provide you with advice and support to help you speak to your employer and convince them to do what's been described as the right thing. And that's even if you've been working back on your employer's premises for a while because you got asked to go back to doing so weeks ago. Because we know that happened too, mostly in businesses which sought to fit themselves into the essential bracket, which includes 13 sectors which have been deemed critical national infrastructure sectors. The thing is though, not all operations within these sectors are essential. And it's certainly not essential that they're all done on site, with the potential increased exposure and therefore risk level that comes with that. By enabling you to work from home, your employer would be contributing to the public health effort, protecting our communities, protecting your families. If you need our help, if one of your loved ones needs our help, you'll get us on 0800 0015 022 or by email at info at scottishhazards.org. Together, let's stop this pandemic at work.